Right. Are you friends of the bride or the groom? Murdoch, this is a funeral, not a wedding. Friends of the groom. Go in front, then. Fool. Thank you all for coming here today. You'll find information on the deceased in your hymnal pamphlet. Teresa, Hannibal wanted you to have this. I just feel like if I hadn't come to him, that none of this would have happened. He died trying to help us. He died trying to help all of us. Follow me down this way. Hannibal never looked so good. Dearly beloved, I do believe that the deceased would appreciate the swift commencement of this brief ceremony that marks his final day among those of us who appear to be at least cognizant of life. He came to us like a shamrock on a sunny day. He graced our lives like a, uh, uh, like an avocado salad. He was a man given to feeding people. He saw empty stomachs everywhere he went. Well, let's have a handful of deceased. And, well, a moment of silent prayer would be better, silent prayer. Greased our lives like an avocado salad. Yeah, sort of uh, lacks the right degree of sentiment, doesn't it? <laughs> Just a babbling fool. Sure, you want to do this, Jack? Great alibi, Travis. Cops will never pin the Irishman on me. Besides, I want these store owners to know. I want them to know that I'm the one who sent the meatball over. You wait here. I got to do this alone. You know, my dear departed father once told me two people who never believe the reports of your death are the one who loves you and the one who hates you. And now, if there be any man here who wishes to speak, let him speak or, or forever hold his peace. On behalf of the American Jukebox Company, I'd like to say, I spit in this man's face. Hi there. Uh, I'm back. Uh, Mr. Lane? I see Mr. Lane. Follow that hearse. Stand on a BA. <laughs> Is that better? Yeah. Huh. 
Mr. Lone, sir, we can't find anybody to read the last rites, so we're going to leave that part of your burial ceremony out. However, we will sing you a merry tune or hum one. Now, before we throw you in the water here, suffice it to say that you'll be missed and that all over town there'll be wild celebrations in your honor. Ah, uh, it's uh, kind of kind of incoherent. Well, if you'd care to tell us who runs your action, uh, we might delay the burial, but I'd have to have a name right away. I can't make this out. This is hysterical. It's hysterical. Mr. Ripper, sir. Now, we know you run the action for some big shot loan shark. And if we're going to close this down, we've got to take out the man at the top. Now, if you tell us who he is, me and my friends would take it as a great piece of cooperation. And we might not drop you in the deep water here. Nathan Vincent! He says it's Nathan Vincent. Nathan Vincent. Nah, I love it when a corpse comes apart. Oh! <laughs>